Hello and welcome to Gigat Play Studio Tutorials. In this tutorial, we're going to look in a filter of Forge to how we can create um, outline. You can see like in this image right here, we have some black outlines. So we'll just look on the component, how we can create this. So let's uh, first loading some image so we can uh, look at that. And to do this, we're going to file and we'll go select the open image. So right here we have an image. Let's go ahead, open a filter editor. I'm using um, filter for each professional so we can create our own filters. Okay, here we have it, our editor. And first let's go external and we'll take image. This is our incoming image. And you can see right here, unmodified image. Next, what I want to do, I want to uh, find edges. The problem is we cannot use just uh, thresholds for this. So example, if we go ahead and use threshold on the sources, you can see we have some black and white. So, but I want just outline going around. Outline is better if we're using, um, so we're going to processing high path. High path will help us to find this edge right here. You can see it where we have it. And again, uh, we can increase slightly contrast, so we'll have it a little bit better. I don't want gray, what I'm looking for this, just a black kind of outlines going. At this point, we actually can go ahead and start using a threshold. Okay. Or other things, what is best, it's using tone curve. So we'll start using this one. Select, let's go inside the curves and just select the gamma curve and connecting. So by using um, proper set our start and end, we can look also, let's kind of just double time click the eye icon and appear so we can lock preview mode. And you can see this point by setting start and end point, we can remove other options and just illuminating some other options and just have this outline around our image. Kind of set this narrow what we want view. So right now and notice we remove the black and everything. We just have this outline of our image. The interesting things what you can do, you can actually combine this with other images. But um, to do this, when you go again in the, um, so let's go to channels, we'll go set set alpha, and we'll go ahead and add source, to actually new alpha right here, we'll invert, and we can set to whatever color we want it. So at this point, you can see we have it alpha applied just to our outline. So in if we wanted to have it even more kind of interesting processing, at this point, we can, can apply anything we wanted as a background and our outline will apply there as well. So let's do a very fast example. We'll put it blend, foreground, and let's do the source. So you can see this is our outline that we applied Right here with alpha, it doesn't um, do anything to our background, but it's how fastest way um, you can create outline with um, in a filter forge. Of course, the thickness of the line you can easily control it by um, working with the contrast increasing because you can see how many lines we can apply to this. So all these options. You can um, provide when you create filters, you can add controls and allow the user to modify this in that filter. Okay, so right here is a very um, kind of example how we can create our with alpha mask basic outline. So we can use it in any other filters. Um, in the next uh, tutorials, we'll also look how to create some interesting backdrops where we can combine with this. Thank you for watching this tutorial from Geek at Play Studio. Please remember visit us on the web is www.geekatplay.com.